Hi, I'm Robert Lavery, president of Robert Lavery & Associates. We're the North American distributors of the Orchid Business System solutions for Sage 300 ERP. The purpose of this video is to give you a quick overview of their key solutions that enhance and extend the functionality of the core business modules of Sage 300 ERP. We start with EFT processing. This is a solution that enhances the payment process as well as AR refunds and AR receipts for Sage 300 customers. We have information from the banking system in North America that there's up to $1 billion of check fraud every year in the banking system. While this represents less than 1% of the total volume of payment transactions, it's still a significant dollar value. And so what we find in practice is that the banks are asking their commercial business customers to consider the use of EFT processing to make electronic payments rather than send paper checks through the banking system. EFT processing is a way for you to not only streamline the payment process and receipt process within Sage 300 ERP, but it's also a way to avoid check fraud and identity theft. In terms of payback for EFT processing, most of our customers tell us that their payback is under 12 months. And that's because of a cost savings in not having to produce paper-based checks and the price of pre-printed check stock. And also the labor cost of having to print, fold and stuff envelopes with check information and remittance advices. And also of course the cost of postage. If you're an organization that's running 50 checks or more on a monthly basis, EFT processing is a solution that you should consider. Your payback is likely to be under 12 months. You'll be green by not having to produce paper-based checks. And you'll also save time and expense in terms of internal labor costs. In addition to sending electronic payments, you can also send the remittance advices via email to your vendor contacts. So we find EFT processing is one of the better selling solutions from the ORCID systems portfolio.